Everybody. Today I'm going to be showing you an array of different styles showing you the differences between human hair and synthetic hair wigs. First off, this human hair wig is from Premier Lace Wigs and the synthetic hair wig today is from Uniwigs. So first things first, I'm going to show you the differences between brushing them. Ooh, fun! Alrighty, so first brushing out my human hair wig. We will definitely have less tangles. And now brushing out the synthetic wig. Whoopsies. Brush the ends. <laughs> In my experience, I have tested wigs many places. Synthetic wigs definitely get tangled a lot more easily. <laughs> now that both wigs are brushed out, let's um let me show you some some different styles you could do. So, first things first, if you are new to wigs, you probably don't know how to hide lace front wigs very well. A lot of first time buyers of synthetic wigs will not be lace front. A lot of them are made so that they have bangs or or you'll see the part is crisscrossed in a way that you don't need uh, to hide any lace because they didn't make it with lace at all. So, But also if you're uncomfortable with lace front anything but you bought a lace front and you don't know what to do with it yet, a good first step is to put a hat on. So here we go, put a little hat on you. Oh, beautiful. Here we go, put my little alien hat on you. Wow, ladies, look at that. to do a half up half down so I'm going to take the hair from the temples and I want to brush all the hair back oh my god look at her oh she's so cute oh my god stop it I love it okay Synthetic wig, your turn. <laughs> so this wig is already a little bit more difficult to pull up because I have to keep running my hands through to stop it from tangling. <laughs> my hand is stuck. Okay, there we go. Now we're gonna brush it up. Brush it up. Okay, okay, this is doable. Okay, how is she looking? How you looking, girl? This is not bad either. Look at these two. Oh my, oh my, stop it. If you were to be wearing this wig half up, <laughs> the only negative thing about this is that when the hair is pulled to the side, you can see all these short, short hairs. And the human hair wig, does not have any short hairs. It's completely concealable all the way around. But the part that was tweezed into this wig did make it a little hard to pull it all up without using any hair product. So not bad at all, but I would say because of underneath the ponytail, the human hair wig wins this round. Next up, I have some little clear hair ties and we are going to do two little ponytails just like how I'm wearing today. Let's do human hair first. So we're grabbing uh, this section right here. She's cute. 
cute, cute. Look at these little babies. I love you. I love you. Okay, synthetics turn. difficult than the first one but we got it and we nailed it oh my oh my ladies <laughs> look at that super cute the back side looks totally fine and and the human hair wig again look good all the way around so for this style, I think both of them pretty much stand on their own. You know, I don't I don't see one winning more than the other. I think if I saw those short hairs on this one, I would say human hair wins. But no, these are pretty even. You can totally do this hairstyle on either uh, human hair or synthetic. Definitely, both win. Next up, let's do two braids. We'll do human hair first. Now, I should say that this is actually a 360 lace wig. That means there is lace in the back, so this lace is not cut. Um, so you can see the lace with a hairstyle like this. But other than that, everything looks really well. Everything looks well? Yeah, everything, everything looks good. <laughs> the synthetic wig. Um, this is this is what this looks like in the back So you can see the tracks, but I mean it's it's not too bad. It's not too bad. It could be worse This does not have lace underneath This just just ends there. Um, but again, we have these little hairs What in the world? I am so confused by these little by these little hairs and the last Hairstyle we're gonna be testing on in these wigs is a high ponytail. Oh boy, okay. as good as it's gonna get there. Oh my god. <laughs> that is probably what that's gonna look like. Well, 
in this competition of ponytail versus ponytail, <laughs> I'm gonna have to say human hair was a lot easier and a lot prettier. Personal preference, I would say human hair wins this one. I don't know about you. I mean, let me know down below if you disagree with anything that I'm saying, or, or you can comment if you do agree too. Whew. Well, thank you all so much for watching my video today, showing you the different hairstyles and which one is better, human hair versus synthetic hair. I do understand synthetic hair is much cheaper, easier to come by, and human hair is more expensive, especially the dyed hair, very hard to get at a good price. To get a realistic synthetic wig, I always recommend getting a lace front wig, plucking your lace front wig, this one is unplucked, and getting a good density. Also, look up reviews on the hair texture because I do have a wide range of synthetic wigs that I've received and some of them feel very realistic and are very silky and others are not. Thank you all so much for watching. Make sure to click the subscribe button down below if you haven't and I will see you next time.